Hello electric car lovers, in this channel I cover all the latest tech news surrounding electric cars. I cover the background, feel and drive, the current selling price and the specs and engineering that go into making each car. If you have an electric car that you'd like me to cover, let me know in the comments below. In today's video, I'm reviewing the upcoming and widely anticipated Cadillac Lyric. I'll be covering the most important features to see whether it'll crush the competition or not with its sexy exterior and luxurious exterior design. And one more thing before I start, I got gas for $1.39 today. Unfortunately, it was a Taco Bell since I drive an EV. Haha. <laughs> okay, now back to the video. The Cadillac Lyric is a new electric crossover that will be manufactured by Cadillac, a part of General Motors. It's Cadillac's first completely electric car and the third GM electric vehicle sold in North America following the Chevrolet Bolt EV and EUV. It has new technologies, a new design style, the capacity to park and unpark itself as well as travel on the motorway without the drive at the wheel. And a new version of General Motors Super Cruise semi-autonomous driving system, the Lyric will be able to not just drive you as it will be available in the United States in 2022 and the 2023 model. For North America, it will be assembled in Spring Hill Manufacturing in Spring Hill, Tennessee and for Asia at the new EV-only plant in Yantai, China. On its existing BEV2 platform, GM produces a number of electric vehicles. CEO Mary Barra disclosed various information about the group's forthcoming line of electric vehicles, including a crossover from Cadillac at the 2019 North American International Auto Show. The Lyric is named after numerous previous Cadillac concept cars, including the Evoque, Provoke and Celestic, with all end and Q. Cadillac's first electric vehicle was given the moniker Lyric since the Cadillac brand is cited more to music lyrics than any other brand, automotive or non-automotive. Cadillac had intended to unveil the Lyric as a show vehicle or concept car in the United States on April 2, 2020, with a launch following shortly after the 2021 model year. It was rescheduled until August 6 due to the lockdown. The Lyric production had also been postponed until early 2022. A new facility in Shanghai is producing for the Chinese and the Asian markets. Spring Hill will begin Lyric assembly for North America somewhat before GM's Yantai complex, which is being developed for Altium. The production version of the Lyric was announced on April 21, 2021, following the public debut of the show vehicle at the Shanghai Auto Show in 2021. LG Chem will provide batteries to both Yantai and Spring Hill with Spring Hill first receiving pouch type Altium cells from an LG Chem factory in South Korea. This will be the case until GM and LG Chem expand Spring Hill to accommodate Altium batteries manufacturing for both local and international markets. Cadillac's parent corporation, General Motors, has announced its intention to become an electric vehicle only car maker by 2035. That's just 14 years away. And there's a lot that has to happen in the meanwhile. The company wants to fit the 118-year-old brand's historic characteristics into a contemporary electric-powered crossover. The all-new Cadillac Lyric for 2023 is a great place to start. The Lyric's introduction is described as a pioneering movement for Cadillac as proven by the fact that it was disclosed more than a year before customer deliveries began. Cadillac's excitement is reasonable since the Lyric offers a highly appealing overall package with plenty of technological technology, the most recent version of the art and science external design language and an interior with a huge LED display panel. Moreover, the Lyric is an excellent everyday vehicle with ample range to carry owners through the week and beyond. Cadillac understands it has to score a home run here because not only is the competition intense but the Lyric's reception also determines the company's destiny, design and engineering. The Lyric is a clean sheet design but it's definitely a Cadillac. Because of the black crystal, the powerful front grille that stands out with a dynamic lighting pattern flowing along the sides and bottom, virtually encircling the brand's insignia. Instead of being incorporated into the headlight assembly, LED daylight running lights are made up of two broad strips, one on each side of the front end. The ultra-narrow LEDs are above them. There are 736 LEDs in total on the outside. Cadillac's so-called black crystal grille is particularly remarkable, as it incorporates dynamic illumination into a flush, laser-blazed, rear surface that delivers a welcoming sequence when the car is opened. Before guests enter the interior, the elegant vertically oriented lamps and lighting choreography offer a luxurious touch. Split taillights that start on the C-pillars and continue and bend downwards towards the back glass give the car an equally distinctive design. A set of extra long lights over the rear bumper again on either side divides the light pattern into two. 20-inch split six-spoke alloy wheels are standard with 22-inch available as an option. 
Stained steel, metallic or stellar black metallic are the only exterior colors available. The black roof and lower body panel combo on the former look excellent. Overall, the Lyric in production appears almost identical to the original idea and design. The most noticeable changes appear to be adjustments to the front and back fascias, as well as wider side mirrors. Interior the inside has a modern and clean style. The Lyric, like the upcoming Escalade 2021, comes equipped with a gigantic 33-inch curved LED display capable of producing over 1 billion colors. The driver's gauge cluster and touchscreen display are both housed in this compartment. HVAC buttons run along a single horizontal strip mildly slanted towards the driver beneath the touchscreen. Standard equipment includes a 19-speaker AKG Studio audio system with headrest speakers. Sky Cool Grey and Neuer are two interior colors available. On either side of the three-spoke steering wheel are controls that regulate speaker volume, Bluetooth, and other infotainment systems as features. When the Lyric arrives in Cadillac dealerships, Apple CarPlay and Android Auto and a Wi-Fi hotspot are likely to be standard features. The gear selection dial is located in the area nearest to the driver while a pair of cup holders are located in the second half of the central console. A sophisticated noise cancellation mechanism is also included. Designers were meticulous in the attention to the tiniest of elements, intricate laser etched designs through the wood over metal trim, for example, are the first of any car for any automaker. The actual vehicle features a more typical backbench seat, despite the concept vehicle having just four seats and a center console that splits the two front and two rear seats. With a touchscreen for the rear seat occupants, the internal passenger volume of the two-row Lyric is 105 cubic feet. There's 28 cubic feet of cargo space behind the back seats, which extends to 60.8 cubic feet when the seats are folded flat. Cadillac says that using the dedicated EV architecture allows for a more airy and open cabin with plenty of space for passengers to get comfortable. Performance Anyone worried about a lack of performance might relax after hearing the next few sentences. The Lyric, which is built on the Altium platform, is powered by a 12-module, 100kWh battery pack that produces 340 horsepower and 325 pound-feet of torque. Drivers should expect a range of roughly 300 miles. The Lyric will be available in rear-wheel drive with an electric motor on the rear axle as standard. All-wheel drive will be available as an option and will add a second motor to the drive for the front wheels. So far, Cadillac has remained tight-lipped regarding the Lyric's all-wheel drive drivetrain, so we have no idea how much horsepower it will produce. Because of the rapid nature of the electric motor's power supply, acceleration will be quick in any case, at least at lower speeds. The Jaguar I-Pace, for example, accelerates to 60 miles per hour in under 4.3 seconds. The Lyric is predicted to perform similarly, regardless of the Lyric's 5,610 pound curb weight. Regen on demand technology and one pedal driving are two more significant features. When used together, they allow drivers to regulate how quickly the car slows down and comes to a complete stop by applying hand pressure to the steering wheel mounted paddle. Battery life With the Lyric, GM is introducing Altium, a new series of electric vehicle batteries. The scalable technology allows the manufacturer to build batteries with capacities ranging from 50.0 kWh to 200 kWh, with the biggest size designated for huge EV pickup trucks, like the future GMC Hummer EV SUV. The Lyric, according to Cadillac, will have a battery capacity of over 100 kWh and should be capable of driving ranges of more than 300 miles per charge. Because of its DC fast charging capability, it can add 76 miles of range in around 10 minutes at 190 kW charging stations. You can obtain over 200 miles of range in 30 minutes. A dual-level charge connection and a 19.2 kW home charging module are also included, allowing for 52 miles of range per charging hour. Price and model range Not only is the Lyric a new nameplate for Cadillac, but it's also the brand's first all-electric vehicle. When it goes on sale, it'll go against some major hitters. Cadillac has revealed that the Lyric will start at $59,990 in 2023. There's also the 7500 federal tax credit to consider, as well as various state-specific incentives. Reservations for the production will begin in September in Spring Hill, Tennessee. The first deliveries will begin in the first half of 2022, so yet Cadillac has only divulged the Lyric's starting price. Here's the price estimation for each trim. The luxury trim will cost $59,995, the premium luxury will cost $70,000, the sports trim will cost $80,000, the platinum will cost $90,000. The all-electric SUV as well as premium EVs like the Lyric are predicted to grow in popularity. The Tesla Model Y will be its major competitor upon debut. Both vehicles are comparable in size. I'll bet the Tesla has a small third row. 
The Model Y is similarly less expensive at first, although the performance variation is just a few thousand dollars more expensive than the Lyric. The Audi e-tron, which starts at $65,900 before tax incentives, is another possible competitor. The Cadillac Lyric has the potential to help the brand reposition itself for the new e-mobility age. Let's hope it meets our expectations. This wraps up my review of the Cadillac Lyric. Let me know what you think of it. Thank you for sticking it out through the very end of this video. Nothing helps out my channel more than y'all watching the entire video. These videos take a long time to make and they are a labor of love. If you'd like to see my channel grow, please help spread the word. And until next time, remember, the best experiences aren't about where you end up, but who you're lucky enough to be on the journey with.